Hello everyone, my name is Derek, Victor Alpha 4, Alpha Foxtrot Kilo. In this video, I'm going to show you how to upgrade the iOS on a Cisco 3850 series switch from a 3.x.x to a 3.y.y in install mode. Before we continue, make sure that we have free space on the device before we copy the flash file over. To do this, we run software clean. Please ignore the stack power redundancy loss messages as this switch has been pulled from a stack power configuration and is going to continue to spam us. As we can see here, the cleanup was successful as no unnecessary packages or provisioning files were found, so there's nothing to clean. Next, we're going to copy the bin file from our source location, whether it be TFTP, FTP, SCP. In this example, I'm using a USB flash drive just to make it easier. So we're going to do a DIR USB flash zero. We're going to upgrade in this example from 3.6.6 to 3.6.8. So we're going to highlight this information as we're going to need it later. So we're going to go copy USB flash zero, put in our file name to flash, leave the file name the same. Once the copy is complete, verify that the file is on flash. As we can see here, the file has been successfully copied to Flash. Next, we're going to do we're going to type software install file flash. We're going to paste in our bin file name. Switch now, because this is a single switch, we're only going to enter the enter the number one. Um, if this switch was in a stack with multiple switches, you would enter the the range of switches. For example, in a three switch stack, you'd go one dash three. Next, we're going to do verbose. The reason why I do this is that way, if there's any error messages, I'd like to see what's happening. We're going to go new because we need to create a new packages.conf file, which will point to the new files that are created as part of the install process. And force. This will help fix any errors um, that help come up in the installation process. We're going to press enter. And the installation process begins. Once the installation is completed, you will be prompted with the option to reload. In this example, we're going to click yes. And I would suggest saving the configuration. The switch is now going to reload. All right, now that the switch is finished upgrading, we're going to verify the code upgrade. We're going to go show ver. We can verify here that switch one has been upgraded successfully to version 030608 with mode install. Thanks. Have a great day.